bit more. Uh, I was gonna make this a cook, but 15 seconds isn't enough time to explain this. Uh, but it is gonna be a quick video, but this is what I'm currently doing. So, um, if you can see right here, I have, uh, using me on one side, and then my text has to go on the other side. Uh, this is how I'm teaching myself to cut now, which I didn't do this before, and this is why I'm making this video, because now I feel like I can actually master JavaScript. Uh, because I'm doing this, what I'm actually doing is, so, for each chapter, he does for each thing, like, like, right now, my numbers, I just did strings, I create a folder in, in my root project, here on VS Code, and title it strings, and then I create an index.html at app.js and in those fold in those files I just create a bowl a boilerplate html document and then add in the app.js file to it. And then I go into the app.js file and I code the line the course and so what I'm doing right now is I didn't do this in the past I would like watch a video tutorial and watch them build a project then go back over the same video and actually do the project but I, I never actually took learning the language Seriously, and that's what I'm doing now with this is, I'm, as he's going through the video, he'll uh, write new lines of code, console them out in, into the JavaScript console, and then comment it out. And what it does is, uh, as, as I'm writing it out, I'm I'm making a reference for myself so that whenever I after I take this course master JavaScript, I'll be able to go back and just pull up my VS code and look at any file that I want is structured the way I want so it's easy to find strings, numbers, variables, objects, arrays, stuff like that, functions. Uh, I did type a function. Well, what does an object look like? Look like? It's all right here in comments and it might be its code so it looks beautiful. And I recommend this for anybody. If you want to learn a language, if you want to develop, this is what you got to do. got to treat it seriously. Like, how would you learn a language in school? It's pretty much the same thing. If you don't use it, you lose it. You had to constantly rewrite over and over again, write down, listen to it over, uh, how did you pronounce the word, stuff like that is all the same in computer science. Instead of learning a foreign language, you're learning a computer language, and you had to speak that computer language to the computer, and it has made specific rules that you must follow, syntax and stuff like that. So, it is important that you, you, you take learning the language seriously so that, uh, 
you understand how every part works, how it all plays together, and as I'm doing, like, if you want to learn JavaScript, I recommend buying this course off of Udemy from the Net Ninja. Uh, I found them on YouTube. It makes learning JavaScript fun. So, just to let you know how I'm, how I'm learning, if you want to learn JavaScript, there'll be a link to the course below if you want to get it. So, uh, on his uh, YouTube as well. But, he has the first six hours of this course for free on YouTube. And, uh, and that's what I do first. Like, watch that. Wait, excuse me. Watch that. And then if you really like it and really decide to enjoy it, then invest in the course. And it's only 12 99 It's actually very cheap. So... Ain't my game for this. But that, and since my nose is right, I'm going to end it up. But I pretty much got everything I wanted. But I'm not stopping until I master JavaScript. I, I have to master JavaScript. And uh, that's another thing about coding is Pick a language and stick with it. Pick a path and stick with it. Pick a tech tag, tech stack and stick with it. I already have my figured out. Now, I have to learn JavaScript, I'm going to learn React and learn Gatsby and put it all together. Uh, because with Gatsby, I can connect the WordPress there a Shopify site and I want to be a freelance developer and being able to provide that to my clients would be awesome. So, uh, that is seven minutes in. I'm going to leave it there. Thank y'all for watching. Uh, and thank y'all for the likes and the comments and all the new subscribers. If you haven't Alright, be sure to subscribe for more videos about web development, traveling, um, flying, and, uh, that just, well, but yeah, uh, subscribe for more.